Welcome everyone, and thank you for joining me in what will be a video trilogy where I will teach you how to master helicopter landings in Arma 3. Starting from basic techniques and progressing to advanced maneuvers, each video will guide you step by step to ensure precision in your landings. So with that, let's get started. My goal with this first video is to lay a solid foundation that we'll build off of in videos 2 and 3. We are starting off in a hummingbird helicopter. Double tap the minus key on your number pad to increase the field of view. Press right control M to bring up the mini map. The first piece in this puzzle called landing is being able to maintain a controlled hover. What I'd like you to do is simply lift off and hover the helicopter in one position. The goal here is to maintain the hover without drifting forward, back, or sideways. When performing this exercise, feel free to change altitude and reestablish a hover, focusing on not allowing the helicopter to drift. Once you're able to consistently hover without drifting, you can move on to the next skill, which is gliding. Gliding is simply flying the helicopter with the collective held down. This is the critical step to scrubbing speed in order to set up for a landing. To practice this skill, fly your helicopter to a cruising speed of at least 240 kilometers an hour and then hold the collective down. Now continue to fly the helicopter in a straight line, keeping the nose of the helicopter at the horizon and focusing on flying as far as you can. When you slow to about 50 kilometers an hour, pull full collective and try it again. Here's another example, but this time my altitude is much lower. You will also notice that I will raise the collective earlier as I near the ground. Next, we will combine the glide with the hover. The setup is the same as the glide skill. The one thing you want to focus on is to not raise the collective higher than needed to maintain a hover. Listen for when I start to raise the collective. And finally, we tie it all together, the glide to the hover to landing. Everything is the same as before, but now we will lower the collective after establishing a momentary hover. It should look like this. All right, everyone, that's it for today. From here on out, the program only accelerates, so make sure you practice these simple techniques to prepare yourself for the upcoming videos. The next videos will focus on spot landings, the three different types of LZs, and the critical steps, some might say secrets, to achieve precision in your landings.